And of course, we're down here with Kelly Ellis on the red carpet. Kelly, tell me about your experience. Oh, this has been absolutely phenomenal. Um, I got to be a cast member of this amazing movie and um, being a sounding board, of course, for John and his support. And he actually came up to me one morning about a year ago and said, got an idea. Normally that, that scares me because he has got about a million ideas. But this one really stood out as something phenomenal. It seemed like something bigger than anything we've ever done before. So to be a part of this has just been an absolute amazing ride to watch. It's been amazing. Love it. It's amazing. So many people showing up, so many cameras, all the lights. Just it's, awesome. It, it makes it fun. And John really wanted everyone to have the experience and everyone walk the red carpet and really feel the excitement of this. And it's, it's, start, it's happening. It's starting to happen right now. It's really neat. So good to see you and finally meet you. And that's going to be fun. It's going to be a blast. Thanks for being here. Thank you. And we're down here with Jeff Lewis on the red carpet right here at the Compass. Jeff, how was your experience with the, making the movie and all of the activities going on with the production? Everything has been absolutely wonderful. We've been treated great and it's just a surprise to both of us that we're even involved in this thing. But we're very thankful about it. We're very excited. And now we're with Frank McGuire. Frank, tell us how you got involved with the movie and John. Well, Graham, I've uh, known John about John for a long time and he's quite a professional. And Aggie Coburn, one of my closest personal friends, told me about this movie and invited me to the world premiere. So I'm here, even got my hat on. I love your hat. Are you a cowboy? Uh, no, I'm a New York City kid. I know about hubcaps, nothing about cows. Well, good to see you, and I'm glad you're out here. Thank Have a you, good Graham. time. It's a pleasure to know you. Good to know you. On the red carpet with Gina Keel right here from the Real Housewives of Orange County. Gina, how are you today? I'm great. I'm so excited for John. This is such a big project and it's just great that he got it done and we're all here at the premiere. We're really excited. Now, how do you know John originally? John saw first season of uh, the Real Housewives and decided I needed a trainer and made it his personal mission to get me in shape. So he's been your trainer for how long now? He's been my trainer for about four years, although this last year he's been slacking a little bit because he's been so busy with the movie. So. Well, you look like you're in great shape, and it's always great to see you. It's great to see you too, Graham. Normally I see you on TV, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, tell us all about what you've done with the movie. I have no idea what I've done with the movie. I haven't seen it yet. I'm going to see it tonight. Then I can come back out and tell you. Supposedly I'm in it. Supposedly I'm in it about 11 times. John came to me and asked me to be in the movie to give people a pep talk, to give them some motivation, some inspiration. So I met with him when he was filming this part of it in Dallas, and I did my song and dance. After that, he does his magic, and it turns into something called a compass. We're here with Jonathan Beal. Jonathan, tell us about how you got involved with the compass. Well, a lot of my friends who are um, doing amazing things in the world. Uh, all have told me that um, I need to be here for the Compass. Um, in fact, I was at a um, uh, at an event with Joe Vitale down in Austin a couple of weeks ago, and uh, he invited me to come up and um, made sure that I was here for for this. But he's not the only guy who has said that I really needed to be here and participate. So um, it's hard to it's hard to not. Uh, and listen to all your friends when they say you better come here for the compass. Here we are with Tim Ralston. Tim, tell us all about your involvement with the compass. Great. Well, um, it was, first of all, a pleasure to be here and to be involved with something this big. Uh, Debbie Allen was the one who was uh, responsible for bringing me in to uh, talk with John and bring a tool that we developed, which is the um, vision board, um, to uh, make a vision board for the compass. So once you find that, that inner direction that you really want to see it, believe it, receive it, then that vision board helps you um, see that on a daily basis, keeps you really focused. So um, it's just been a really wonderful journey and we hope that it can just keep continue going from there. Amazing and really good to meet you. Thank you very much. Kelly Calabrese, tell us how you met John and what you've been doing with him lately. Okay, I actually contacted John about seven years ago. We're both in the fitness industry, and I called him because I was so impressed by his resume to co-author a book with me called The Power of Champions, and he agreed. Beautiful, and you got involved with his boot camps? Yes, I started his boot camps about three years ago, and he actually made me the international master trainer for Adventure Boot Camp, so we've been having a lot of fun going around doing that, opening up 300 boot camps. And I heard you're actually in the movie The Compass. I am. John invited me to be in the movie. We've been working on this for almost a year. And if anyone can pull this off, John can. It's been an amazing journey, and we're so excited for tonight. 
Beautiful. So good to meet you, and I can't wait to see the movie. Thank you. It's my pleasure to be here. Down here enjoying the red carpet festivities with Michelle and Vanessa. Tell us how you met John and how you got involved with this whole program. Oh my goodness. Friends for years and just here to support everything that he does. He's a beautiful person that has a gigantic heart that's all about contributing positive, incredible information to the world. And I've never had the pleasure of meeting him in person, but I do know him through Michelle's company, Effortless Living Institute. And uh, from what I understand, he just does some fabulous coaching and some fabulous work. So, honored to be here. And of course, John Spencer Ellis and Tony, there he is with his business card. Look at that right there. John, tell us your feelings. How are you feeling today? Uh, uh, astonished, grateful, uh, overwhelmed, uh, highly in demand, pulled in several directions. Uh, astonished, happy. astonished. Happy. Oh, of course. I mean, that goes without saying. I I'm, I'm uh, overwhelmed with the response. It's just, it's so cool that, you know, people say, well, it's your baby. Uh, yes and no. I mean, I made it, but I made it for everyone. It's, it's for everyone, and many people collaborated on it. And then uh, Tony Giri has a big part in it as well. He's, he has a very unique perspective that he brings to the film. And that was the cool thing about it is we were able to bring people with all these diverse backgrounds to appeal to a wide range of people because everyone has a different compass.